What's happening, YouTube? Jake back with another real and fake video. And of course, you guys see in the title, it is the uh, Varsity Royal 3 Real Fake. And you guys that's uh, been following my channel, subscribed to my channel, seen uh, the initial review of the uh, Varsity Royals that I got from GOAT. And uh, these are those right here. And I just got these actually Wednesday. Wednesday from Cross the Water. So we're going to do the review. Let's get this thing started. Of course, we're going to start with the box. And even from here, you can see the elephant print. Uh, the pattern is different. Also, you can just see like the, the finish on the box. But let's go look at that label. Real close look at the label. And of course, it's a UK release. So there is no price tag. Fake box which is actually a bit bigger, a bit larger than the uh, original box. But then you see the tag and it has the price on it, which that would be a huge red flag already since it's just a UK release. You can see the box is all ash and beat up the replicated box. You see the finish on it. This is a legit pair. Uh, let's take a look under it. See if there's anything weird under here. No, let's take a look under this one. Ah. Same old, same old, just really, really, really beat up under the box. All right, look at that. Take a look under the box. See if any stampings or any sorts, nothing. Nothing here as well. That's a fake one. All right. And this is a legit pair and all of its legit glory. Very, very beautiful. Let's take a real good look. The color, blocking scheme, patterns. Go around on it. All right, let's bring out these fakes. Ew. Ew. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, nah. No, 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 no. Typical uh, replicated Jordan 3 again. Same. Uh, I think the only good one I've seen was the denim. But you can see right here. Two different shades of blue. How can you get the blue wrong? Come on. How are you gonna get the blue wrong? Uh, giant elephant print once again. They can never get this whole anchor, anchor, um, anchor, ankle collar right. And the the stitching around the eyelet right here up top. Actually, it looks pretty good but it's, they just can't get it like this. Complete difference. Has the air tab in the back. Um, I'm going to get the, that's the right shoe. All right, so looking here, real shoe is on the left, fake shoe is on the right. Uh, also, when I always talk about the scale, how everything's a bit bigger on the fake shoe, this is where I'm trying to get at. The large elephant print, the large air tab, heel tab, that says air on it. Everything's scale larger on the shoe. Shoes fit true to size, but this is just a little bit, it's a wider shoe. But if you get a 12 or 11 or whatever, it's gonna fit, you know what I mean? It's not gonna be a tight fit. It's actually gonna be a looser fit than the original threes. But there you go, look at that. That alone, I can stop the video. All right, we're gonna get deep into it. Start getting in there. Shoe tree, old school shoe tree wrapped in paper. This is the fake shoe. Let's look at your production date. Can't miss it. 12, 4, 19 to 9, 10, 20. Fake shoe, real shoe. Correct shoe tree, molded sock liner, look at the production date.
12, 18, 19, 8, 24, 20. My eyes deceiving me? It can't be 8, 24, 20. 3, 24, 20. I just woke up in the morning. I'm sorry, guys. My eyes are killing me right now. Ah. 3, 24, 20. And I'm saying 8, 24, not even in August, man. Eyes are deceiving me. No editing. It is what it is. Whew. All right. Moving along. This is the real shoe. Of course, the UK versions usually have that sticker inside. Uh, white jump man. We're going to take a look at the sole. Fake shoe here. There's a size 12 sticker in there. White man, white jump man on the sole, insole, and this one. This one actually seems a bit thicker. So, real is at the bottom, fake is at the top. I actually give a plus to the fake, actually. Fake's actually a bit better. On the insole, let's take a look inside the shoe of the fake. Jip pair. Constructed just about the same. Put that back in here. The elephant print. Dead giveaway on the fake threes. Large elephant print. They can't get that front. They can never get the front toe box correct. This is the real pair. And just how, look how sleek it is. Look at the lining. And look at that. It's just extra large. Just can't, just can't get it right. You can see the pattern, the star pattern on the sole. It's larger here. You definitely see the differences on the shoe. Let's take a look at the jump man. Fake jump man. Got them thick thighs. Just better than most, but yeah. See the Jordan here, the jump man. You see he's looked like he's reaching up. This one. Yeah, you don't know what he's really doing. Let me put this insole back in. We're gonna take a look at the AirPod and uh, and get some closer details. I'm just gonna show some details to see if you guys can catch anything. So you guys can comment in the comment section. What do you guys see uh, the differences? All right, we're gonna go and look at the AirPod. Usually on these AirPods, you can see, I'm trying to get in here. The plastic isn't like a smooth finish on it. It's always rough. It's never smooth because they, they don't expect you, the replicators don't expect you to see that. To see the imperfections in the AirPod. You can see a little roughness in here. But when you look on a legit pair, you don't see, you don't see what you see there. It's always going to be clear and smooth. And this is what you're going to have to get to. Is you're going to have to get to this point of looking at the air, the fine details on a, re on, a, on a real and a fake shoe to make sure you're getting a legit pair. Because, you know, you guys might think they don't care when, uh, you know, uh, manufacturers, manufa man man manufacturers make things. You think they don't care. You know what I mean? You talk about Nike Air. So they're going to take pride in this air pocket. For your comfort or whatever and they're not going to make it i'm gonna say half ass you know what i mean they're going to make it right so these replicators aren't going to make it right just like sometimes the, the, the yeezys with the boost um some may some fake replicate replicators make it right and some don't but uh so this is this is one of the differences and if you ever talk to a manufacturer from china or anything like that they'll tell you sometimes they might get to look right sometimes they might not 
But one thing that's never going to be right is the cortex, the inside of the shoe. It's not going to be right. Most of the time, if you cut these things in half, it's not going to be the same. All right, so now this is the fake shoe. Take a good look here, stitching, eyelids. What do you find that I did not catch? Because like I said, I just woke up. You guys forgive me, but I had to get this video out because I don't think I'll be able to do it um, tonight after I get off of work, I have to do some things after work, so. And while I'm spinning the sucker around, once again, I got an L on everything trying to get those Jordan 12 University goals, black and yellow, thunder, whatever they want to call them. Uh, got screwed again by all the foot sites. Now I have to deal with sneakers app. Hopefully I can get a W and uh, by some other means as well. So friends, family, yada, yada. Oh, this is so beautiful. It's always nice to know when you deal with, you know, fake shoes and then you get the real shoe, you get to appreciate the real shoe and you know what you're getting, you know? Loving it. I'm gonna take a look at the, uh, it's the real shoe, go around on it in all its glory. And I'm gonna pull out this fake shoe. Let's look at the laces, lace bag and all that stuff before I forget. These are, this is the lace bag and how it's laced, how they're rolled up. It's the fake pair. Color, mm, this looks like a little bit a more bolder blue. This one looks more of a, yeah, it's not as bold. White laces are white laces. And this actually, this, this tote box look even looks different. It's a different shape. Oh, people just don't, mm, I, Colors, colors bother me. That dull top color is bothering the nonsense out of me. Uh, people like to know if I buy my fakes. Yes, I buy my fakes. Every single one of them, except for maybe three. So all my real fake videos, yes. And updated fakes and all that, yes, I purchased. That's why I have my you know, my PayPal, if you appreciate what I'm doing, my PayPal, my cash app, anything like that. If you want to donate, you know what I mean? I also do legit checks and stuff like that. I'm doing it for free. I, I'm not, it's not something that I advertise, but, you know, people. a lot of people ask me on my Instagram, you know, can I check, can you check this and check that? And, you know, I'm being, you know, gr gracious. And I just say, yeah, I'll check it out for you. I'll check it out for you. But, you know, hey, that takes a lot of time. You know what I mean? I'm pulling out my shoes. I'm pulling out the fake ones. I'm pulling out the real ones going through details and stuff, sending pictures back and forth. So, hey, if you appreciate what I'm doing, hey, shoot your brother man a donation. Time is money. Time is money. And I don't like to say no to people, you know? So, it's going to get to that point. Because it's taking a lot of time from me. And I also, like, I, I contact people like, when I'm working and stuff like that. So, it's taking time away from me. So, even my production at work, so... Cause you know, a lot of people are demanding and they're like, you know, answer me and that this is, Hey, I got a full-time job and I work longer than full-time. So please be understanding with me. This is not what I do all day. Uh, like comment. That's why I'm do videos at weird times, six o'clock, three o'clock, one o'clock in the morning, just grinding. You know what I mean? Uh, appreciate the grind. Um, like comment, share, subscribe. If you like what I'm putting down, if not, Hey, it is what it is, man. Thanks for watching. Appreciate y'all. It's your boy Jake signing out. More videos coming. Peace out.